This channel makes over $16,000 every single month and they generate over 133,000 views on average every single day. And not just that, they also gain over 1,000 subscribers every single day. Now, how cool is this? The most interesting part of it is that this niche is easy to create using the AI tool that I'm going to be introducing to you in this video. So if you're looking to start your own faceless YouTube channel and start making a lot of money from the comfort of your home, but you don't have time to create videos yourself, then this video is for you. All you have to do is to just come closer and let's dive in. Now to get started, the first thing we need to do is to look at the niche and see what others are doing so that we can model what is already working and use that to also to generate our own videos and to do that all we have to do is to come over to our browser and visit youtube.com of course and once it opens you're going to go ahead and type in bible inspirational versus prayer and here you can see that a lot of channels are doing well in this niche now if we scroll down you can see that even this one is currently live and 795 people are currently watching this now for 795 people to be watching it live that means is actually a huge one and if we scroll down you can see that this video was uploaded one year ago and it has gotten 2.4 million views and it's currently getting 227 views per hour and if you scroll further down you can see that this one was uploaded four years ago and it's still getting 506 views per hour and so far it has gotten 9.2 million views now how cool is this the next step we're going to take is to find a video idea that is going to likely go viral like this one and to do that, all we have to do is to check out the channel itself, okay? Once you check out the channel itself, you're going to click on videos and make sure you install VidIQ extension. It's so good that you're going to get a lot of information using the VidIQ extension. I've done a tutorial on this and I'm going to be leaving it in the description. Or you can go ahead and click here to watch it, of course, after watching this video. So now that we have this, we can see a lot of videos here. This one was posted 18 hours ago and it has gotten 54,000 views and it's currently getting 1,900 views per hour now that's an amazing views per hour but we're not going to be considering this as a good content idea yet because it's a new content the channel subscribers will still be watching it and that might be the reason why you have 1900 views per hour here so what we want to do is we want to look for videos that are actually aged maybe three months ten months one year two years five years but are still getting views. That's how you know the videos that are in demand, the video that people want to watch. I don't know if that makes sense to you, but if it does, please go ahead and like this video so that I can get encouraged to make more videos like this for you, right? So now that we are here, we are going to look at videos that are aged, you know, older videos that, that are still getting a lot of views per hour. And one thing I also want to point out before we find the video that we're going to use, you can see that this channel is uploading every day, right? Running a YouTube channel is not a walk in the park, right? It takes a lot of energy, it takes a lot of work, you have to work and it never slows down. In fact, it gets worse as the channel grows, right? So if you're looking to start a YouTube channel, whether it's a faceless YouTube channel or a personality channel like this, you should be ready to work. But thank goodness, there is an AI that I'm going to be introducing to you in this video that makes it easy and super fast to create videos. So you can be churning out a lot of videos with just a few clicks. Now, how cool is this? So for the purpose of this tutorial, we're going to be using this. This video was uploaded three weeks ago and it's currently getting 329 views per hour. And the amazing part of it is that this video is three hours, 40 minutes and 58 seconds long. Now, how cool is this? So now what we're going to do is that we're going to take ideas from this video and we're going to recreate ours now that we know that people are interested in this so we're going to just go ahead and recreate the same thing and to do that all we have to do is to come over to our browser and we're going to visit chat gpt of course so once chat gpt is opened the next thing we're going to do is to look at the idea that we have here anointed psalm prayers to fall asleep right so what we're going to do is that we're going to ask chat gpt to generate something similar to this and to do that all we have to do is to come over to my gospel inspirational quotes channel prompts i'm going to be letting you know how you can get this from towards the end of this video so do well to get your hands on this prompt. It's totally free. I'll make it available for free so that you can use the guide from this prompt to generate your own videos, right? So what we're going to do is to go ahead and copy this and we're going to come back to ChatGPT and simply paste it 
Here, generate 100 strong prayer points using Psalm in the Bible, right? We're going to then go ahead and click it and let ChatGPT come up with the prayers. And now ChatGPT is done generating the 100 prayer points for us. And it's very cool. And what we're going to be doing next is we're going to come to our prompt library and we're going to copy this prompt. Okay, we're going to copy this prompt next and we're going to come here and paste it. Develop each prayer point into a two paragraph prayer. Ensure each prayer is up to 300 words to make the prayer sessions extended and meaningful. Let the prayers be deeply spiritual and include verses. Okay, let's remove this Bible and add verses. Include some verses to support each prayer session because we are trying to generate the prayers from Psalm, the book of Psalm. So we're going to say include Psalm verses, okay? Verses from the book of Psalm. Okay, let's use that. I think that sounds better. So I'm going to remove that and come here. Verses from the book of Psalm to support each prayer session. So now that we have this, we're going to go ahead and send it and let ChatGPT develop the prayer points. Now, how cool is this? And now you can see that it's done developing the 100 prayer points. If you're going to be making a video this long, how are you going to be editing it? Because of course, you might not have the time to sit down and spend hours and days editing one video to upload and then you'll need to upload the next day and you need to upload the next day. And that is where HitPile comes in. That is the AI tool that I've been talking about. I love the tool so much because it made my job very, very easy. When I found out about this tool, I asked myself, what have I been doing all this while, right? So what we're going to do here is just come over to a new tab and we're going to go ahead and visit HitPile.com, okay? Visit hitpile.com. I'm going to be leaving the link in the description so that it'd be very easy for you to reach it. And once you're here, the next thing you're going to do is to click on this drop down menu, video AI, and you're going to scroll to HitPal AD Maker. I don't know if I pronounced that right, but let's go ahead and click on it. And it's going to open like this. And the next thing you're going to do is to click on get started for free. So you're going to click on get started for free and it's going to download straight to your device. As you can see, I've downloaded before. I've downloaded both of them. I'm going to be doing a different tutorial for the heat power video converter. It's something that you really need, but, but I'm going to be talking about that much later in another video. But this one, we're going to be downloading heat power ED maker. And to do that, all we have to do is to click on save and it's going to go ahead and download to our device and now we're going to go ahead and open it and we're going to then click on the file to install it to our device now this software is available both on windows and apple so anybody can use it right so now you have this do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device of course yes and now all you have to do is to click on install and it's going to install to your device and you're good to go. A few moments later. So now we're done with the installation. We're going to go ahead and run the installed software. And to do that, I'm just going to go ahead and click on it, hit power AD maker. This tool does everything, everything for you, both the voiceover, generating avatar, generating the images and everything you can ever think of with just a few clicks. So if you want to make money running a faceless YouTube channel and you don't have the time to start creating videos yourself, this is definitely for you. So now that I have this opened, the next thing we're going to do is to go through some of the options that we have here. So this is screen recorder. You can use it to record your screen. Of course, the way you're seeing the screen, I used it to record this screen that you're seeing on your screen. Wow, too many screens in one sentence. <laughs> and here is AI video generator. This is the one we're going to be using, but we're going to be coming back to it shortly. And here is text to speech. So if you want to generate voiceover for your project, this is the one for you. And it's so amazing that you can use just one software to do a lot of things because this one is AI avatar. You can generate an AI avatar anytime, any day. And then this one is video downloader. Now I'm not going to mention some platforms so that they don't take this video down. But with this, you can download a lot of videos from different platforms. Now, how cool is this? So now that we have this sorted out, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to click on AI video generator because that is why we're here. Let's say you want to make a video. 
but you don't even know the type of video you want to make, right? You don't know how to come up with the video idea or whatever. You can actually use this AI copywriting to write your script and then the AI tool is going to generate video for you, right? <laughs> This is cool. So now that I have this, the next thing I want to do is to come back to ChatGPT and of course, copy our prayer point. So you're going to copy everything and then you're going to come back to hit pow, okay? Come back to hit pow and paste this like this. And the next thing we're going to do is to click on next. And now we have this. So the next thing we're going to do is to go ahead and click on auto pick. Now what this means is that it's going to automatically pick the images for you, right? By itself, right? It's going to just figure out, okay, this is the image that best suits this. It's just going to go ahead and pick it for you. When I said you just generate videos with just few clicks without having to spend so much time, hours and days working on one video. Now, this is what I mean, right? Well, it's been selected. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to come over to this side and there are a lot of options here. Here you can see 16 by nine. You can choose the ratio that you want it. Is it 16 by nine? Is it one-on-one? -on -one? or is it nine by 16? But for the purpose of this tutorial, we are working with 16 by nine. So now that we have this selected, we are going to come over to voiceover. So this is very important. We're going to be switching on the voiceover like so. We are going to switch on the voiceover. We're going to then come here to select the voice that we want. They have so many realistic monetizable uncopyrighted voices that you can use if you want a woman's voice, a male voice, you have all of them here. All you have to do is to just play back anyone that sounds better to you, depending on the project that you're using it for, you're going to then use that. And one thing I want to advise or recommend is that if you're going to be running this niche, if you're going to be using this niche, you should look for calm, subtle voice, okay? Calm voice, suiting voice, not aggressive voice or deep bass voice or something. Use something very calm and suiting to the voice because his prayers is, is Bible verses, right? So you need that calm tone, right? So for the purpose of this story, I'm just going to randomly select one voice like so, okay? And I'm going to go ahead and click on confirm. And of course, I'm going to go ahead and turn off the subtitle, okay? You can go ahead and turn it on, but I just feel that subtitles sometimes can be distracting since YouTube generates subtitles for you automatically. So having two subtitles can be confusing sometimes and most YouTube users don't know how to turn off the auto caption. So I'm just going to go ahead and turn it off. And for music, of course, please go ahead and turn it off. I'm not sure if you're going to get copyright strike. I'm not sure if the songs that are here are copyright free. So in order not to get into problem with YouTube and then you get demonetized or you don't get monetized or your video don't get monetized or someone will be sharing your revenue with you, it's best to uncheck this. So now I've turned this up. Now you can see that it's done picking the images for us. The next thing we're going to do is to go ahead and click on export to export our video. Our video is ready. So here we're going to go ahead and name it whatever we want. We can name it test and we're going to go ahead and select where we want it to be saved to. So for this purpose, I'm going to go ahead and select videos and I'm going to click on select folder and the next thing is I'm going to go ahead and click on export. Just in case you want to tweak some things, you want to juggle things, you want to move things around, then let me show you how to go through the advanced edit, okay? So now that we have selected everything, we have auto picked the images and all of that, but there are some changes you want to make in the video. To do that, all you have to do is come over here and click on advanced edit. It opens like cut cut. Oh, cool. How cool is this? But this is more outstanding, more amazing than CapCut and is way cheaper to use than CapCut because now on CapCut, everything, everything is paid for. Everything, everything is paid for. So now all you have to do, let's say you want to have maybe one image, just one image, and then the voiceovers and all of that. All you have to do is you can just go ahead and remove all these images like so. And you're going to go ahead, let's go ahead and expand this and we're going to drag the image like so, all right, from beginning to end. Let's say I don't like this image and I wanna change it, but I, I don't have the time to start sourcing for images, copyright free images, of course. And that is where all this option comes in. You have Pixabay, you have Unsplash, you have Giphy.gif, okay? So now we're going to go ahead and try out Unsplash 
and you can search real time real time you can search for any type of image here and drag it and drop it on your project and you're good to go this is so incredible so you don't need to do anything else you just search for the things that you need and just use that using this platform so it generates the audio for you it generates the images for you and everything now how cool is this so to do that all we have to do is to search for bible right and now we have this how cool is this and we're going to just go ahead and click on download let's say we want to use this one we'll click on download to download it to our project so now it's been downloaded we can go ahead and add it to our project like this okay add it to our project like this we can even choose to use it to replace this one to replace it we just go ahead and remove this and we're going to go ahead and drag this to the end and we are also going to expand this like so expand it so that it can fit into the screen because we want that 16 by 9 effect and this is so cool but let's say you want to use videos instead like we see some of the people in the niche use videos for their videos a lot of videos in one sentence <laughs> let's say you want to do that the next thing you're going to do is to come over to pixabay and you're going to see a bunch of videos and you can see this one is amazing and this one is also amazing you can go ahead and search for a specific type of video that you want to see this one is also amazing and all you have to do is to just go ahead and download whichever one that you want and for the purpose of this tutorial i'm just going to go ahead and download this by clicking on this arrow that is pointing down click on it and it's going to go ahead and download like this and you can see how it looks it looks pretty cool and the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and remove this and we're going to drag and drop the video right so now that we have the video the next thing we're going to do because the video will not be able to cover our voiceover and we can't drag it because it's not an image so what we are going to do in this situation is to just copy and paste okay copy and paste then repeat the same thing again come here paste it all right repeat the same thing and keep repeating the same thing till we get to the end right and when you're done all you have to do is to click on export to export this to your device and you're good to go now how cool is this i'm going to be leaving the link to this ai tool in the description just like i said earlier so that i can go ahead and get your hands on it and try it out and see how it's going to save a lot of time for you and again if you want to get my little prompt library i'm going to also drop it on our telegram channel if you haven't joined the telegram channel please find the link in the description as well to join the telegram channel it's free to join there i share everything and anything that i can share on youtube because of guidelines and restrictions and all of that so i'm going to be dropping the prompt library on the telegram channel just go over there to get the prompt library now if you want to learn more about this niche i've done a tutorial in the past breaking it down more so if you want to learn more just go ahead and click on this video to learn more about this niche that i'm talking about the bible inspirational quotes but if you have seen this then this is the next video that youtube recommends that you watch on this channel so go ahead and watch either of them and thank me later see you on either side <laughs> ciao